Nobody does Star Wars like the power of the Force from Kenner. Hey Star Wars fans, welcome back to another episode of Power of the Force Friday. We're looking at the original old smoothie himself, Mr. Lando Calrissian, with all his muscular glory. <laughs> Have a look at it. It's so funny. Oh, this is this, this is just absolutely one of the buffest, one of the buffest figures out there. You know, in, especially in Power of the Force. You know, this is uh, you know, he's got the quite a six pack there, unless you count the pecs. But boy, yeah, I've been doing a few push-ups. What can I say? I spend a lot of time in the gym. Been drinking cold forty-five. <laughs> No, I love Lando, I love Billy D. Williams. He's just the best. Look at this cape, you know, you know, it's sort of sculpted, molded glory. Nice peg in the back where it can go in. And I like the blue slacks. He's sort of got his got his business slacks on. I think that looks great. He comes with the blaster. And uh, we'll, let's consult the book again. You know, if you haven't seen this book, I talked about it in the first episode of Power of the Force Friday. Lando Calrissian, 1995. In the 10 years between action figure lines, new materials and molding techniques made fixed but still flowing capes look possible. Making flowing capes possible. So we have the old Power of the Force, 1985. Lando, and then the next one we have the Skiff Guard and uh, General Lando Calrissian. And uh, we are getting a update to that was the most recent sort of basic version of Empire Strikes Back Lando 2004. So we're looking about 17 years since we've had a figure, um, unless you count this sort of comic pack one. Uh, he's got the red cape. So sort of not super accurate, and uh, yeah, we are getting one this year. So looking forward to finally getting a nice three and three quarter inch updated Lando Calrissian. Um, considering you know that's considering the technology and the sculpt of the time, that looks like Billy D to me. A little bit of extra plastic there. I'm just gonna try and scratch off. But uh, I don't know. I think it looks all right to me. What can I say? I'm an extremely handsome man. I don't know, what do you guys think? You digging it? I'm digging it for, for purely a nostalgic purpose. You know, I've been lucky enough to meet Billy D. Williams, had my photo with him, so I have an I have some I feel like I've got a little bit more of an emotional tie um to Lando than I did before meeting him. Um and yeah, I'll always love Lando. Always have loved Lando, but I don't know. There's just a little bit more to him now that I've, you know, been able to, you know, shake his hand and 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 have my photograph with him. So I do need to do a little video on some of my autographs and stuff. Seeing as, you know, I'm probably not going to be able to travel to any conventions in the coming years, um, sadly, just due to the way the world is. So I'm gonna have to enjoy what I've got, and hopefully. Hopefully we can make it happen again one day. But I, I, I do love this figure a lot. <laughs> I think it's great. I um, yeah, he, he's cool. I like the blue. I just love love the sort of Cloud City outfit he has. I wish they could have like put him back in something similar in uh, Rise of Skywalker as opposed to the yellow. Well, I like the yellow. I think it looks good. You know, Lando's there to make a statement. What can I say? I like bright colours. I like to be the centre of attention. It uh, works every time. If 
you want to look at something interesting about Billy Dear Williams, he released a album about 20 years before, no, 17 years before his appearance in Empire Strikes Back. He was a young, young 23-year-old man, young Billy D. An album called Let's Misbehave. Rebel Force Radio recently just did an episode sort of going through and, and chatting about the album. And it's, uh, you know, on all the streaming services, so... You know, young Billy D uh, crooning for the ladies. It's a bit, of, a bit of lounge sort of style music, old sort of jazzy feel. Love it, fantastic stuff. Alright guys, let me know what you think in the comments below. Please sound out and let me know what you think. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you haven't. If you're new around here, I do a Power of the Force figure review every single Friday. Almost every single Friday. Some Fridays I don't. Most Fridays I do. <laughs> so definitely stick around and hang out and uh, join in the nostalgic fun. Also check the description for all my links to social media. I also have a Redbubble store with merch that I designed myself. I need to do something Lando inspired. I need to. I could just put a photo of this figure on a on a t-shirt and I think it would sell like hotcakes. Um, and yeah, I also have a PO box that you can send send a nice letter if you if you'd like to do something like that. And I'll uh, I'll read out the letter and do whatever on on, on an on a video. So thank you all very much for watching. I've been Billy D. Williams, Lando Calrissian. And I'll see you on the next video. May the force be with you. Always.